Y'all ready? <laughs> let's go, let's go. Hey, my connectors, welcome back to the channel. If you're new to the channel, hit subscribe, join the family. If you like good food, it's the place to be. Come have a little fun with your girl, KC. What's up, my connectors? <laughs> my connectors. What's up, my connectors? Welcome back to the channel. I'm sorry, I'm screaming, I'm hyper today. So um, today we are finally doing the 10 pound crawfish challenge, which was um, started by Tosh Point Fro. If you're not following her channel, follow her channel, show her some love. She is, she has a phenomenal channel. She is growing, um, doing great things. You've heard me talk about her. She's a very beautiful girl inside and out. So what's up sis? I'm finally doing the challenge. I know it's been forever. But um, yeah, I have 10 pounds, so I'm going to go ahead and get started. And yes, y'all, I'm going to be talking probably throughout this whole thing because I'm lit live. I'm, I'm hyper today. I'm happy today. Today is a new day. So I hope y'all are doing well. I have this, um, oh, that juicy. I got this uh, garlic butter I had over here yesterday. And, oh, you know what I want, though? Best friend. I bet y'all say, uh-uh, we ain't finna have all this hollering today. I hope y'all can see this. I changed the um camera thing. I apologize if you can't see it. But I hope you can. Mm. They flavorful. There ain't no pro, but don't uh don't push me. Oh, I gotta try to uh do it professionally. I told y'all I was gonna try. And last time I had lemon. And the crawfish eaters was like, no, don't put no lemon on them. Well, that's a bad thing. Why you ain't tell me? I'm too tired of my husband. <laughs> Let me turn my phone off because he's going to keep texting. Girl, I'm busy. I mean, I'm busy, sir. Mm. <clears throat> And I know, uh oh, the thing, I, I might be able to, hold on. So I ain't doing finna do nothing but waste time trying to get that out of there like that. This man, for real, y'all, I apologize. Alright, so I don't know where I stopped off, but uh, he had, he called. He, I guess t I wasn't texting back fast enough, child. What we was talking about, y'all, I don't know. So, y'all. Oh, the lemon. They were saying don't eat it with the lemon. There ain't no pro at this, y'all, at all. But, uh, and that's a whole bunch of them. And I don't want this video to be, I ain't going to say that because it always, it's always long when I say that. Mm. But I want to, Kiana, to make me some, um, a dip she be making. So, this is 10 pounds. So, I want to do this video early. Because my phone probably going to be ringing off the hook. Because, <clears throat> uh, you know, when my husband and my sister, they have sudden estate, they, they want you to stop right then. Talk to me. I don't know what that is that flew in my face. It's probably still there. So what's up, y'all? I'm excited. So I'm just going to tell you right off the bat, I'll be drinking water for the rest of the month. <laughs> well, not the rest of the month. I'm lying. I'll be drinking water. and stuff. I'm all over the place y'all. I'm happy. I love being ha I love being happy. I guess that's why you gotta have the, um, the bad, not bad days. I shouldn't say bad days because I guess you gotta have those days where you're just not feeling yourself. So you can really appreciate the days that you feeling like this. <laughs> I feel like this. I feel like, come on y'all, let's make some drinks and eat some crawfish and have some fun. That's what I feel like today. 
<laughs> That's crazy. Cause yesterday I was not feeling it. Mm. I'm not finna uh, play with the, the claws. I know it's meat there, y'all. And I'm um, probably not finna suck all these heads. Can you? You can't say that, can you? I'm not finna. Uh, never mind. Just let's just go on. But anyway. So like I told y'all, when you start feeling like that, you got to make sure you do things to get you back in track, on track. So I had to do that. I had to just take a break, step away, because I never want to get overwhelmed and I never want to stop having fun and I never want to stop talking to y'all. So I have to do things to kind of get me back on track. Mm, sorry. And that's what I had to do. So this morning, I went back to my routine. Listening and <clears throat> reading the things that always get me back on track. So I did that. And just like that, I'm happy. <laughs> Grateful. Well, you know, sometimes, you know, we'd be like... I want this and I want that and I want this to happen and I want that to happen and I'm one of those people child I'm one of those people honey how you gonna be asking for something and you can't handle what you got now like girl sit down sit down asking for more and can't handle what you got Y'all know people like that. That's me. That's what we're gonna do. We're gonna talk about this girl today. Y'all know I don't I don't do all that gossiping and stuff. So we're gonna talk about this girl today. We're gonna talk about her today. Cause can't nobody talk about you the way you can talk about yourself. You know what I'm saying? Can't nobody talk about you the way you can talk about yourself. Everything else is speculation. Everybody outside of you is usually speculating or think they know you or good or bad. But I can talk about myself. Let me tell you about me. I'm forever asking for something. And can't maintain what I got. Like, stop asking for more of this and more of that and you don't even have a, prog or a process or a ritual or a routine in place to handle what you have stop girl stop oh I got it but it's so good I hope I don't need the Lord do you think I need the Lord this camera so y'all can see the crawfish because as the power go down Cause y'all don't need to see the top of my head. Y'all know what this weed look like. Child. Y'all already know. Watch he text again. Once he start on a... I be all over the place. Once he start on something, he can't stop. But I know how he feel. Cause I'm hyped too. I'm hyped and I'm happy. Let me tell y'all how he get on my nerves though. He ain't gonna watch it so don't worry about it. It's between us. Like when we getting ready to go somewhere or do something, he does this countdown thing because I'm never ready. But yeah, he does this whole countdown thing like, um, hey, we have, <laughs> we have 56 days remaining. <laughs> like, would you stop? Every, this is every day until we go. And I'm still not ready. I know that aggravates him. I know y'all probably like, that don't make no sense. If a man plans an entire trip for me, and I ain't got to do nothing but show up with my suitcase, I'd be ready. You say that. You would not be ready. <laughs> you would not be ready. I'm so hyped. I'm so ready. Ready, ready, ready. All you got to do is just pack your clothes. You ain't got to plan nothing. Nothing. 
You so spoiled. Oh my God. <laughs> Look at him. This coffee is really good today. And oh, I'm hungry. I am hungry because I didn't eat. I made sure. I didn't drink nothing. I didn't eat nothing. I want to get up and do this. What is he doing out there? Child, eat eggs and carry on. Ooh. Okay, I'm not. Oh. <sighs> I don't want to be bothered with nobody's eggs and all that. Oh, somebody said it wasn't eggs, but it is eggs. That's what um, I looked it up. And it said eggs. I already said it on the thing now. If it's a lie, they said it. But some people eat them. It says as long as they orange, you can eat them. I'm glad they're not salty. I had them one time when they were salty. I don't like them salty. Mm-hmm. So, what else I want to tell you? Oh, yeah, so I was talking about myself. And I was sitting there asking for because I know a lot of times we want stuff to happen, like, overnight and all that. Um... We haven't really found a routine to maintain what we have. You know what I'm saying? Like, you want so much more. And when you get there, then what? What happens then? What's the plan? And I said to myself, I don't know. Right, so what are you doing? I don't know, child. I didn't, I didn't know, you know. So I had, had, to, had to do a little reading and stuff. Get myself back on track. That's like somebody, you know what I'm saying? That's like somebody want to have a baby. Like, want to give birth. They want to have the process of giving birth. They want to feel what it's like. They want to go through the months. But they don't want the pain. They don't want the labor pains. They don't want the um, morning sickness. They don't want the fatigue that comes with it. I don't want any of that. But you want to give birth. So that ain't happening. You don't want the headaches. You don't want the hair loss. You don't want the heartburn. All of that comes with it. So everything you ask for always comes with something. So stop asking for stuff if you're not willing to take what it comes with. You know what I'm saying? <clears throat> I'm talking to myself, y'all. You better to stop. I'm like, dog, girl, you right. Told you my phone, didn't I tell you? It's going to be non-stop. My phone is about to be non-stop today. Oh, my God. Kiana! I forgot. Didn't I tell y'all about the um air purifier over there? Yeah. Can you come do me two favors? Can one, can you turn off the air purifier? I'm sorry, y'all. That's about the fourth video. Y'all hear the difference? Yeah, so, um, yeah, I apologize. That's the second time I've been recording with that air purifier. We got an air purifier. I don't know if I told y'all in the other video. So, when you're cooking yeah, things. Stuff the yeah, so, because when you're cooking seafood or fried stuff, you don't want the entire house to smell like that. So, it takes that smell away. Oh, I forgot to uh, light that candle, too. Do you want me to light it? Yeah, light it up, baby. I don't need him coming home talking about what you cooked today. Don't worry about it. But anyway, yeah, so if you find stuff not moving the way you want it to move or the way you thought it would move or whatever, that's what's probably going on. But that's what that's what I had to, I had to reevaluate some stuff today because... 
and trust the process. I know I said this before, but sometimes you got to remind yourself. I got juice all over my face, but it's fine. Um, to trust the process. Trust the process. Fall in love with the process. Create a habit and a routine that makes things easier on you. Because if what you're doing right now is not flowing, then when you get more, it's going to be even harder and, and you're going to be more stressed and unhappy. So, that's what you need to fall in love with. That's what you need to find a routine in. Find a routine that works for you, that makes things easy for you. And that way you don't have to second guess. And that's what I had to do. That's what I had to do, y'all. So anyways, I ain't come to talk y'all head off. Because we got a lot of crawfish to eat. This is 10 pounds. I know everybody done did the challenge except me. But they really good today. I know y'all like, you ain't eating crawfish, you ain't sucking the head. Okay, you won. But. Mmm. Yeah, I choke. <clears throat> I really want to snatch it out the, the, the tail without, um. I love that cracking sound. Ooh, that's a lot of meat. Ooh, I'm making a whole mess. That's why I'm doing this video early because, ooh, that claw look big. Look at this claw. Mm. That's why I'm trying to do it early so I can clean up this mess. Taste the sauce right there. It's good. Yeah, dog. You eating the sauce ain't got nothing to eat with it. <laughs> this, um, the little stuff the girl made for me. Thank you, little girl. I think that's all I need. Just I have a name. <laughs> What's your name, baby kid daughter? You know, I really do feel like disrespected. Girlish. Hey, do you want to taste the crawfish? Creepy. You ain't gonna like it. Oh, God. I'm gonna. Do you have another load to go in the washing machine? Um, I think that's it. Just them towels. Alright. Yeah, just the towels. Woo! If I put it down, maybe we can fall in love. Y'all, what y'all want to talk about? What y'all? How many minutes? Oh my lord, let me hurry up. Y'all, we're gonna be here. We ain't gonna be here long. Let me just stop talking. I'm gonna be talking to y'all. I'm not. Girl, that sounds good. That dip. I know, right? No, I'm not. Huh? So, like, I totally learned that. Do you know how mustard is way better than regular mustard? What I was saying? Mm -hmm. It's good. I know. Get it, girl. I know y'all can't see that. Mm, mm, mm. Baby, we can fall in love. Mm. It was really good. It took it to another level. <laughs> he is going to show out. Woo. Uh, if y'all not following him on Instagram, it is Casey underscore connection. So you may want to follow me on there. On Insta. That's all I'm going to say. Mm. 
That's it for that. I started to tell y'all to ask me some questions. So um, I can answer some of y'all questions. Let me see if I can remember some of the questions I'm asked. Um, who does my hair? These just wigs I pop on right before the camera. I thought I answered that already, but some people knew. I pop on, pop on. Um, what else? What else do people ask me? Mm, mm, mm. Oh, do I cook my seafood? Yes. Except the fried stuff. Keanu cook it. I'm excited, y'all. I bet y'all say, about what? <sighs> Wish I could say. Mm-hmm. Oh, let me say thank you so much to everybody who's been leaving comments. I know for the last couple of ones, I haven't been able to answer every single one. So thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you for understanding and patience. All that good stuff. That's a lot. Girl. So no cheese. You don't do, you're not doing no dairy anymore. Yeah, I'm working on it. That's good. Go ahead, girl. I'm like just like like seeing what works and like That's what your dad did. He basically just saw what worked for him. So he's not really, that's why when people say, oh, are you vegan? Are you vegetarian? Are you whole? But he's, he's just like, I'm figuring it all out. Because, you know, you know if some if you're a vegan and somebody see you eat meat or something, like, what are you doing? I don't want to say I'm vegan because, like, yeah. I'm not, I'm just, like, seeing what I can do at the moment. Right, just like, trying to make improvements. I feel you, little girl. Next step, I'm going to try to make vegan lasagna, so... If that works out, then I yeah. feel like I'm all good to do more. Oh, that's good. Because I found out you could totally make a replacement for ricotta cheese. Yeah. Yeah, you don't have to be boxed in. Just find your own lane. Plus, plus, since Dad doesn't like cooking, I can cook these things. I can totally cook these things. Like, I want to make my own sauce. My yeah, own girl, because when he get in the kitchen, honey, he use every single pot, pan, spoon, <laughs> knife. <laughs> cook, like paper cook, towel. If I cook, maybe we'll have more things that everyone can eat. Yeah. No offense, Dad. It's just like the French toast thing. Yeah, I don't know what it is. Sometimes, some of this stuff come out really good, and other times, I'd be like, uh-uh, that is straight cardboard. I can't do it. I'm trying to convert Khalil at the moment. <laughs> the, th the funny thing about Khalil is once he get, makes his mind up, and he is strictly, he is disciplined and committed. Yeah, like, he literally told me, one day, I was just like, screw it, and then started. Yeah, that's what he told me. He was like, I just decided I didn't want to be fat, and I just lost the weight. I'm like, I wish it was that easy for me. Well, I guess it is. I've done it several times, but. I know, like, when it comes to all of us, if we put our minds to it, we can literally do anything. Basically, that's everybody. Oh, my God. Well, Sorry. I, they're making it it, too. What's it? It's the clown. It the clown? It the clown. Check it out. See it? Oh, I thought they just—I thought that just came out. It. Um, that was With like the balloon. A year ago. Was it a year ago? Yeah. Oh wow. I can't believe they're making an it too. I never watched none of that. You never watched it. I watched it because Khalil said it wasn't scary. I hadn't been to the movies in so long. It's because you fall asleep during the movies when we do. Yo, that. I think it's something wrong with me. Like every time every I go to the movie, every single time you fall asleep, I go straight to sleep. No matter how good it is, no matter how interested I am, it's almost like I got narcolepsy and I can't stay awake when I get to the movie theater. I just can't stay awake. That's crazy. 
Like I can go to sleep standing up. I can, <laughs> what? I can go to sleep in my in anything. Clothes, suits, shoes. You no, know some people gotta get uncomfortable. I mean get comfortable, unwind and all that kind of stuff. When I'm sleepy, I go to sleep. When we're in um when we were in private school, I remember like we'd have to wake up at like six AM and I wasn't equipped for that. So when we wait for dad to get ready, I would lay on the floor and just sleep. And I swear this floor was like the most comfortable place I had ever been. Even like riding in a car, you know how some people be like, I cannot sleep in a car. People are like that. Yeah, a lot of people can't sleep in a car because they feel like they have to see, not me. Oh, I'm sleeping on an airplane. Some people can't sleep on an airplane either. I go straight to sleep before we take off. I always miss the juice. You know, little peanuts and juice. I'd be like, I have to tell the person next to me, wake me up when they come around. I remember that. I remember? <laughs> yeah, I remember that. <laughs> We was on what floor? Four flights to Hawaii. Every flight, I was asleep. I was uncomfortable. <laughs> like I could go to sleep, but I was a bit uncomfortable. Four flights to and from Hawaii, I was not that. Couldn't do it. So yeah, yeah, yeah. Me and Glo are like up front just watching movies and TV shows. Mm -mm -mm. And like every time, I was like, Dad. Can we get like this lunch thing? It, it looks good. And you always say no. And I'm like, why though? <laughs> I think it's because, like, is the airplane food not, like, good? I think that's why. I don't know. I don't like eating on the airplane. I like the airport food. I like buying me something from the, like, the food court part mm -hmm. and bringing it on the plane. I didn't realize 10 pounds was a lot. Girl. You didn't realize 10 pounds? I mean, I realized it was a lot, but I didn't think it was going to take me this long. That water good? Whew. Mm. Excuse me. Excuse me, y'all. If you put it down. Still don't feel like overly full or anything. I think the water fills you up more than anything. You're eating a bunch of tiny meat. I know, right? And what'd you say you got Chipotle? Mm -hmm. With no sour cream? Yeah, no sour cream and no cheese and no meat. No meat, no child cream, and no cheese. You doing it, girl. Yeah. It's a really good thing I barely liked meat in the first place. Because it would be really hard if I didn't. Is it light? You know how sometimes when you pick up your Chipotle, you'd be like, ooh, it's heavy, packed in there. What? Literally, like, if you don't get meat... It's called a veggie uh, bowl. Oh, it's cheaper. And it's, yeah, it's so much cheaper. Mm-hmm. So I'm saving money and my life. Girl. Put them chuck. Put them chuck. Oh, y'all, I don't think as you get full, you get tired of chewing. Yes, yeah, Oh, show okay. The peoples. Oh, show the, yeah, show the people. This is a veggie bowl, y'all. Now I gotta wait for my camera to focus back again. Oh, it smells good. I smells good. Really hungry, I yeah, I was hungry today too. Y'all, I think you just get tired of working for the meat. That's a good job in the city. so much for joining me i really do appreciate it i tried y'all i can't go no more i don't i mean i'm not full but i just don't want no more much love peace and blessings to each and every one of you and until the next video continue making connections with endless possibilities i do love you bye y'all